Yeah. Why did you turn it in? Uh, that's just part of our policy. So oh, because you had conduct, contact with me? Anytime somebody has uh, what we perceive to be like a, a complaint or something like that, it's part of our policy that we have to know the fire chain. So you that. had contact with me that night, is that what you're saying? Well, so you and I had contact. Right. You and I spoke to one of them. Uh-huh. Um, of course, not official police interaction. Oh, I knew you'd throw that in there so you wouldn't say, say you had to name yourself. Yeah, that's slick. But again, he's a coward, but it's slick. You know who I am now. I do now. Oh, trust me, the world's going to know who you are for this is all said and done. Trust me, because this ain't even close to being over. All right, good citizens. Thank you for coming to my channel. If you are first time viewer, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell for future video notifications. This video is from YouTube channel Big G Audit. The original link is in the description. Please subscribe and give credits where credit is due. Guys, when you are watching this video here, please don't forget to subscribe and post your comments. And as always guys, if you would like to support my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Enjoy the video, let's get it into it. Uh, I'm just here, we just had somebody call uh, to say they saw you walking around the parking lot. Yeah. So of course you had a Yeah, I've been inside, been on every floor and ones they'd let me go to anyway. They even yeah. escorted me through a couple of floors there. Yeah. Uh, I just come by just to make sure that you know, you wouldn't wave it again in the parking lot or nothing. Oh, no, sir. I wouldn't do that. That'd be against the law. Okay. I don't uh, break the law, sir. You're, you're perfectly fine to tell them and all that good stuff. Mm-hmm. Uh, do you have any questions or anything? Uh, the only question I have is you the one that I stopped over at the cookout that night? That's correct. I figured that was you. What's your name? Uh, Dunworth. My last name is Dunworth. Okay. Yeah, right? they wouldn't give it to me, and you wouldn't give it to me that night, so. No, that's uh, it's written on our policy. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I know. That's pretty shitty policy. I'm going to do all my best to get that changed. It should be like Solon County, and you just give it to anybody that asks. Whether you're off-duty or on-duty, that's supposed to be, should be part of your policies. Well, I, I understand why you, why you think that. Right? So, yeah. Uh, I appreciate the retaliation you did against me, too. That was very nice of you. So, uh, if you look at your court documents on that, you'll find that that wasn't actually my arrest. Well, I know you didn't sign it. The judge has to. Oh, yeah, Judge Tui signed that. No, don't worry about that. No, I mean, so my name's on the affidavit. I'm not the, uh, I'm not the one that actually wrote that. So. Okay, well, then how'd they even know about it unless your little whiny ass just went and told them? I didn't say the word. Well, okay. I turned it into, mm -hmm. so I turned that into my lieutenant as part of our policy. Turned it into? Yeah. But why'd you turn it in? Uh, that's just part of our policy. So oh, because you had conduct, contact with me? Has So you had contact with me that night, is that what you're saying? Well, so you and I had contact, right. and I spoke to one of them. Uh -huh. um, of course, not official police Oh, I knew you'd throw that in there so you wouldn't say you had to name yourself. Yeah, that's slick. But again, He's a coward, but it's slick. You know who I am now. I do now. Oh, trust me, the world's going to know who you are before this is all said and done. Trust me, because this ain't even close to being over. Absolutely. Close. You motherfuckers come to my house at 5 o'clock in the goddamn morning, Waking up my kids and pushing past my mom. This is long from over, motherfucker. You're going to see my face quite often, so get used to it. Best knowing name, I goes for you too, buddy. What's your name? Thank you. I appreciate that. That's good to you. Do you, uh, do you have any other questions? I don't never had a question for you to start with. Okay. Well, uh, you'll just do me one favor just watching the track plane. I don't want you to get run up. I don't do favors for pigs, man. Okay. You can just cough. That right there is what you call the walk of shame, boys. I appreciate you coming and getting me at 5 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, you're about a cocksucker. You and your buddy there can go f*** yourselves. So, as you can see, this officer is trying to play all body body. But this, this is the same uh, officer that is responsible for a judge signing a warrant to enter Big G's home. So this cop clearly doesn't like or respect what Big G does. Sometimes we have to see with our child eye because these cops will hid behind a wall of fakeness in the camera's eye. They will portray 
to be nice or cordial, but deep down, they're out to get you, and Big G knows that. That's why Big G led into him here. So, the big takeaway from this clip, I would say, don't be fooled if you're out here fighting for our rights and picking up the camera and feminine or local law enforcement. The meat smile in front of your face, but as soon as the cameras turn off, they would do everything in their power to try to bring you down and make your life a living hell. So, so, Big G, good luck with these tyrants and be safe out there. That's gonna do it for this video. Much love to honor our video. Make sure you use the link in the description to show them some love and check out his most recent videos. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video. Bye.